Hey everyone, hope you're staying uh, warm and dry after the big uh, new northeast blizzards, the snow thingy. I just got done shoveling out the driveway and the walkway and the basketball court because uh, it's never too early to start practicing your basketball skills, right Lucas? Yep, right Louie. And uh, we did this uh, video yesterday, a uh, loot crate. Uh, we're going to do a little, we had a little prequel thing to it while the snow was falling, but we got lost track of time, had a lot of fun while we were being snowed in. So the intro is a little off, but I uh, hope you enjoy this loot crate for this month, and I hope you're enjoying the snow, and of course, go Patriots! Yeah! Well, Luke, it looks like we're going to be down here for a while with all this snow, so you want to get open in this nerd block? Yeah! Alright, this is the nerd block for January 2016. Uh, I have a feeling I'm not going to like this nerd block much Why? this month. Because the theme, uh, there's a couple Harry Potter items. Huh? I'm not a big Harry Potter guy, but... Uh, my mom is. <laughs> yeah, my wife is, so I'm sure she'll appreciate it. So we're going to try to stay warm. I got the heater on down here. And we're going to do what we usually do with these mystery boxes. What we're going to do is we're going to open it up. Lucas is going to reach in blindly. Take one item. We're going to show it off, talk about it. I'll reach in, we'll alternate the entire time till the box is empty. At the end, we'll show off everything one more time and tell you if we think it was worth the money this month. So what do you say we get started, buddy? Yeah. There we go. And if you like what you see in the nerd block, you wish you got it, there's a link in the comments below or the description of the video. If you click on it and subscribe, we get a little bit of uh, funds back so we can buy more boxes to open for you. Do it up, bud. Reach in. Okay, okay. Whoa. First item. Big oh. item, big item. And it is Game of Thrones. Legendary Collection Tyron was. Lannister. Lannister. I don't play this game. <laughs> well, this is actually not a game. This is a, a TV series I, on HBO. I don't watch it either. Yeah, I don't watch it either. Uh, but he is the uh, small person who's one of the Lannisters. Very important. I don't know if these are random or not, but... Uh, in series one, there's Jon Snow, the, uh, this figure, the Hound, the White Walker, uh, and Ned Stark, among others. So there you go. If you're into Game of Thrones, you'll probably find something to like about that. I'll do the t-shirt. And it is... What is that? That is a, a great question. Doesn't say. Yeah. Oh, is that Harry Potter, Potter's wand? Oh, that's ah. a Harry Potter theme shirt. Actually, that's not that that bad. You got the little scar on his skull. Ah. The wand. Yeah, that's What's actually. What's the triangle though? Uh, don't know. We have to. Ask. I've watched all the Harry Potter movies and read half of the books, but uh, not that into it. So that's actually kind of a cool shirt. Not as goofy as I expected. There's barely anything left in it already. It, this is a. Young, never-ending story. Your never-ending story. Never-ending story was a movie that came out in the mid-80s about a young boy who gets transported to a magical land through a book. The book is called The Never-Ending Story because it, people keep getting sucked in and it keeps going on and on. This looks like a uh, never-ending story, a little replica journal that you can write in. You never, it says yours, so it's probably yep. ours. This is going to be your story that you're going to write when you get sucked into the world. Pretty cool. They actually have like a giant uh, dog, flying dog that the character wrote on. I haven't seen this movie in a long time. It actually may be a movie you guys would uh, enjoy. Well, now we'll have to check it out. Yeah, this, there, there isn't much in this box left, is there? What do we got? We got a Harry Potter Hogwarts Crest Keychain. So there you go. Hogwarts, all four schools represented. Slytherin, what? Huff and Puff. Uh, uh, something of another and something of another. <laughs> uh, Slytherin, Huff and Puff. Which one's Huff and Puff? I don't know. And the other two. None of these are exclusive items, as far as I can tell. None of them have the exclusive Nerd Block logo on them. Hmm. So, see, there's one more thing in there you can grab. And it's a Harry Potter bookmark and it looks like a scene from the movie. Hey Potter and the Deadly Hallows. Deathly Hallows Part 2. And we also got a print. A this looks like a the, the Hobbit, movie. actually. Huh? Parsi? 
What is it of? It's uh, where the hobbits live. Oh, so it is from the hobbits. So let's see. Nerd Block. Six inch legacy collection. Uh, okay, so they have all of the entire line of figures uh, randomly inserted. So I got, I kind of wish I got the White Walker, which is the uh, kind of a cool looking one. Um, yeah, those are what they all look like. So. Uh, yeah, it's a scene. That's a film strip from the movie. Ah, oh, if you go through a clear light right yep. through the middle, you can see the color. Yep. So you can kind of see it. Let me put it up against my big forehead there. You can see Harry. Certificate of Authenticity. This certificate of authenticity guarantees this is a genuine official product and manufactured by Trendsetters. Pretty cool. All right. So that was uh, the, that. We had the Shirt Punch Deathly Hollows t-shirt. The Deathly Hollows are depicted in fancy glory. In this exclusive t-shirt from Shirt Punch. Well, oh. there you go. There's an exclusive item. The Harry Potter film cell bookmark. Quite Until quite recently, wizards didn't have a spell to keep their place in their various spell books. That's why they've always been keeping them open on stands. But now, thanks to this breakthrough innovation in film cell science, you can keep track of where you've been in your favorite book. Unreal Estate 4. That's the print concerning hobbits. This wonderful art print from... Nakanti Incorporated artist Tim Doyle depicts Bag End, a.k.a. Bilbo Baggins' house in the Shire. The night oh, the Shire. brings much uncertainty, and the journey ahead will affect everyone, but the comfort of home will not be forgotten. The Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry crest. Uh, trick people into thinking you at the Hogwarts School. They don't list them, so we won't fill you in on that. And the uh, exclusive, I guess it is an exclusive, the Never Ending Story Notebook. This homage to the Never Ending Story allows you to keep track of your own Never Ending Story. Use this to jot down your thoughts and keep track of important tasks or fill it with sketches. The possibilities are unlimited thanks to your endless sure. imagination. Oh, I thought I was going to say your endless And then next <laughs> month, Nerd Block Classic is bringing you an exclusive killer item from Deadpool. Plus, you can also expect a cape crusading item from... Yeah. Superman! No, Batman. Batman, yes. Batman indeed. So Again, that's the next two month. Men so indeed. next month looks a little more uh, up my alley there. Yeah. Uh, I mean, the figure, I don't know what, it, this is just gonna go into the yard sale box. Uh, I don't know if we'll use another keychain or not. The Never Ending Storybook is good, it's a quality item. The Harry Potter film strip is neat, and the Hobbit print is okay, but overall, less than enthused about this month's mm. Nerd Block Classic. Your thoughts, Lucas? It was okay. It was okay. Strictly okay. Uh, I mean, you got the t-shirt, too. Can't forget about that, which is probably the coolest thing, I think, in the whole box. Mm. I mean, yeah, that's really cool. Yeah, that, that is pretty awesome right there. But, uh, so, mi mixed opinions on this one. I less than enthused. Lucas thought it was okay, because he gets a notebook, and he gets a bookmark. But I got a t-shirt that's actually not as bad as some of the other ones. James Bond, shaking not stirred. I'm looking at you. Uh, so overall, it was, you know, it was what it was. So, But if you like Harry Potter, you like Game of Thrones, or God, if you like them both, this was your box. So let us know what you thought in the comments. And again, if you like what you saw, you can subscribe with the link below. And that helps us fund more boxes to do. Uh, we got baseball cards coming in two weeks for Top Series 1 baseball. Uh, if you want to, uh, when we open them up, we're going to pre-sell the teams. So if there's a favorite team you want to pre-sell, I think it's going to be $5, and I'll give you every card, including if it's the big hit that I pull out of the box. Um, something different we're going to try out, kind of a little bit at a time, see how it goes. I'm not all in on it yet, but we'll see. Uh, so if you wanted to get all the cards of your favorite team out of the new top set, uh, definitely uh, let me know. Uh, before we do that break, I believe it's released February 2nd or 3rd. Uh, very cool stuff coming up. That's it for us. Uh, the snow is still howling. We're going to get uh, this little blizzard we have going on. So uh, we're going to stay warm and uh, do some fun things. Lucas yeah. is going to work on a science project. Ah, fun. And I am going to relax and uh, play some video games. Maybe we'll watch a movie later. Uh, we got a good time lined up. We got, we're full of snacks. We're getting ready for the Patriots game tomorrow. So a lot of things going on here in the Northeast. Thank you very much for watching this video. As always, I am Matt. And I'm Lucas. And we will see you guys again very real soon. Bye.